Since we last remmed, we had Reddish Hen with 69 months, very nice, and Admiral627 with a sub. Um, so, a bit of a change of plan here. We were going to be doing a new game called Once Human today uh, with Mark and Adam. Unfortunately, Mark's power is out, I guess, um, from the hurricane thing that has passed through Texas. So, it sounds like that's most likely not happening today. And instead, we are going to do uh, Dead Craft and um, hope that uh, Mark's power comes back at some point by maybe tomorrow. I did say I was around like tonight if, if it gets back up and running, but I'm not sure if that'll end up happening. Um, so maybe tomorrow. Anyway, oh, Zine's power is down too. Dang. Did Austin actually get, like, hit by it? Or is it kind of just, you know, close enough proximity that it's being affected? I am not sure. I suppose I could go and Google... Um, Austin weather slash power outages, but the whole Texas grid is getting either overloaded or taken down bit by bit. It's, um, yeah, geez, if it's not a hurricane, it's an ice storm or something like that. Seems like um, somehow it is. it gets even more hammered than the California power grid, which I thought was bad. Um... Yeah. Uh, whoa. Jonathan, zero, four, R, R, starting us off with a, an Omega 55, zero, sub Gifterino out the gate. Jonathan was like, I didn't want once human. I wanted Minecraft. Here you go. <laughs> um, thank you, Jonathan. Very kind. Very nice of you to do. And, um... Yeah, it also, I saw that uh, Las Vegas hit its hottest temperature of all time. Which I'm actually surprised that Las Vegas had never hit over 120 degrees Fahrenheit. I figured that happened at least once a year, but I guess I was wrong. I just figured that because Palm Springs has hit 120 on numerous occasions, and I've been there when it's been 120 and I wanted to die. Um, I thought that happened in Las Vegas too, but apparently not. Um, apparently Palm Springs just gets hotter every summer. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. Guys, <laughs> wow, it's the hottest summer ever. Homer Simpson. No, guys, it's the hottest summer so far. Uh, Logo, thank you for the five months. Very much appreciated. Um, don't worry, uh, in the next 10 years, I'm sure we'll be hitting some nice 130 degree summers. It is, it is kind of wild. Like, I don't remember it being, uh, perpetually 90 Fahrenheit plus like consistently every single day in late June to early July before. And I just, you know, every year your memory gets kind of wiped because it gets colder in the winter. And then that kind of wipes out your memory of the summer before. But it feels like it's not how it usually is. It doesn't seem like it's usually like that. I, I thought it was still consistently in the 80s Fahrenheit in um like the LA area uh you know i thought it still was in the 80s consistently <coughs> even like a high 70s during the summer i guess not oh my goodness jonathan 04rr back at it again with another 50 
My man's is uh, popping off. Oh my goodness. He's done a hundo out the gate. I don't know what the occasion is. Excited for deceased craft or something like that. I better not die. That would be embarrassing. <laughs> God, wouldn't that be terrible? Logo, thanks for the five months. Sior Nicholas, 50 months, been a long road. Captain by Captain, every episode of Tricky Towers makes me laugh so hard, I'm in a good mood for days. Well, then we should probably try to play more at some point. Uh, Helmy with 47 months. Very cool. Very awesome. Ah, uh, yeah, man, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know about this heat. It just seems like it's not supposed to be. How do you survive in 120 degrees Fahrenheit? Um, you don't. Outside for very long. That's for darn sure. I just don't understand how you have some of the houses in Palm Springs and the golf courses that, that like, have just acres and acres of grass. And, I mean, the golf course, I guess it's an industrial application and, and you know, the membership fees are going to cover it. But, like, I've seen house listings in Palm Springs before that are just acres of grass. There's this one that just stands out of... Um, I can't remember. Was that on? Was it on House Guesser, the, the Palm Springs one? Maybe it was. But it was like, you know, it had um had freaking like two golf holes in the backyard privately for this house. And it was just like your water bill must be like twenty thousand dollars a month at least. <laughs> just the water bill. Hey, yay, yay. That's crazy. I feel it. We have a really bad water bill here at this house, but this that ours would make like that house looks like an Olympic-sized pool in comparison to us being a little kiddie pool, um, and that sort of thing. Anyway, huh? <sighs> um, yeah, when it gets that hot, you just stay inside and you better hope your air conditioner doesn't break. Otherwise, you are actually in an emergency situation. Like, you know, the few days that my air went out, we probably peaked at like 95 degrees. If it was 120, it would actually be like, I have to leave and get a hotel because I will die of heat stroke. Um, all right. Well, anyway, I guess we should get started with uh, playing the video game so people are not super duper bored and stoof. Yeah. It is game time. Let me make sure I have done everything that was needed for in between episodes and stuff. Uh, Kai or K03 with two months. You're my fave streamer. I appreciate that. That's very nice to hear. Pretty swick. Okie dokie. Roy E. Uh, let's see. What have we got going? Look, our otter is still alive. Isn't that exciting? I think that's pretty cool if you ask me. How's our incubation? We got another BB and we got a big guy over here. Let's go. Very exciting. Um, very, very exciting. Okay, cool. So, I'm trying to think what our play is here. What is our play? What do we do today? What do we need to work on? Before we get started, let me just check through our uh, stoof. Let me just check through our stoof real quick. And see where we should be looking. I mean, yeah, we got the... I think I need to do like a check mark there. I don't know if I need to do a check mark there, but we'll see. Um, I obviously need to work towards the tier four stuff. The trouble, obviously, is this thing requires some high resistance fabric, which we don't have easily available for us. Um, we would just need to be able to hit up demolishers. Yeah, it's gonna be rough. Bro, that's gonna be rough. What is the PBF hamster gas mask? What is the difference there? Seven two oh seven two seven two. Huh. 
Oh, also high-res fabric, though, which is fricky. High-res fabric again? Oh, my God. Well, to be fair, what is, like, the... It was last time around we did the Spec Ops set. Spec Ops was... Advanced Electronic Components, Night Vision Module. We basically, right, we need, like, a full set of Netherite. Um, and then we make all the other stuff from it. So, oh god, we also need the high-res for the netherite. Which is great. Great, great, great. So, definitely need the high-res fabric all the way around. Yeah, I could try to get some gun skis out here, but I need more money, unfortunately. I guess we could start out with a little bit of villager, villager stoof. Start off with a little bit of villager stoof, and then maybe try out the other apartment building that has the uh, horde spawn in it. Maybe that's the way. Maybe that's what we gotta do. Maybe it's what we gotta do. We shall see. Anyway. All right. Let's do it. All right, everybody. I just want to start my video, and freaking Alex A just interrupts me. What do you mean? Try that again. That was rude. Incredibly rude. Can you even believe it? Uh, you can get a lot of high-res fabric from the Mega Towers. Oh. God, how do I... The question is, how do I get a freaking car into the subway? That's the question. I don't know how I get a car into the freaking subway. That is a that is gonna be a trick and a half. Um Lusanagi, thank you for the forty seven months. Been a while since I could come to a stream. I hope all is good. Do we have an ETA on the next peen series? We do not have an ETA. Um assemble one, but I would need the uh what I would need is I would need to have... There is one that... I know there was one next to one of the entrances we went into. We could see if it's possible just dive out and get it. I don't know, dude. I don't know. We'll see. All right. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Deceased Craft, brought to you by the like button. Subscribe to Captain Sparkles 2. And of course, if you're interested in grabbing a server and playing this with your friends, check out Apex Hosting and use code Captain Sparkles via the link in the description, and you can do just that. All right, so today, six days to hoard, trickling into our inventory via super magnet, like we did last season, which was very nice. And then we got ample amounts of it from the wasteland once we started going there. So, um, let's figure out the best way to get a car into the subway so we can travel far and try to find maybe a mega tower after we hit up the apartment building. Um, let's see. Um, hmm, hmm, hmm. What's up? What are we saying? What are we saying? Uh, anyway, uh, uh, Jack TKD, four years, happy anniversary to Osil with 18 months. Glad to see Deceased Craft again. It was one of my favorites. Let's go. Very cool. Ugh, okay. Well, do I have everything on me to try to make a run for this? Oh, let me get the, uh, gas, or the jerry can. I do have two jerry cans, actually, which is nice. Uh, I have to fill that one up. Okay, that there. All right. Um, boy. I'm trying to remember where it was that we last saw that car that we were gonna we were gonna go for it. It was at a subway entrance. I can't remember if it was this one. No, it was a subway entrance that was next to a larger apartment by the workshop. Otherwise, we probably... Oh, I don't even know. If, we probably didn't find a body either. Otherwise, we could uh, actually just build our own car without having to go and screwdriver one. Um, do we find any tanks? No. Sadly, no tanks. Big sad.
Oh, I need a screwdriver, wrench, and hammer for the assembly. Ah, okay. I see. In that case, I'll do like six of that. I might need a hopper as well or something like that, I believe. Goodbye to our iron. Okay. Let's take our Omega Speedy thing. <laughs> and um, I guess run some, we'll do some iron into there. And then I can't remember if it just spits out the other side if you right click in order to retrieve it. Um, this might take a little while, but uh, we'll, we'll get there, we'll get, you know? And then it'll come to me and then we just uh, we just keep keep doing that. We just keep doing that. Okay, so that needs to go. Wait a minute. How did I add this? Wait a minute. So we got one more. We got one more sticking out down there. How did I freak this up? I don't know how I freaked this up. Um. So that's one, two, three, four, five. That's only one, two, three, four. That's one, two, three, four, five. That's only one, two, three, wait. What the heck is happening right now? Oh, oh, it doesn't, okay. I was so confused. I was like, it's not rotating. It just, it, it stops at the original position again. But usually I have everything symmetrical when I'm doing this. Okay, you can't do what I was hoping you could do. It, it doesn't work that way. Um, it would have been, yeah, you learn something new about Create every day, huh, don't you? I guess. <laughs> Is that? Yeah, there we go. Okay, we have to just do this by going around. Okay, so that's gonna be... Uppies by one. Good. And then... I guess we'll just do the other side. Or like this. And then, okay, four more. Oh, is that it, basically? I think that was pretty much it. There's only 12. Okay. It's fine. I guess I could add like one more one more tip to each. Can I reach? Can I reach? Nope. Just that. Um, and then I can just go to the floor below. And all right, there we go. We are all good. That'll add fifty percent more stress, and also, um. A little bit more, uh, a little bit more rotation speed out the gate. There we go. Perfect. Beautiful. Very nice. Alrighty. What a beautiful windmill. Or the hammer. Whatever. Can I? I can't remember. Can I put things in here? Oh, I guess I just have to have them, like, on my person is how it works, I think. Alrighty. Well, anyway, let's just, uh, use this opportunity to head over there and, um... Do some good work. I can't make an elevator yet because I don't have slime. Uh, once I have slime, I can do it. How dare you. How dare you be in my subway? 
Oh, does Blood Moon affect Horde Knight if they have it at the same time? That's kind of scary. Uh, let's see. Kalish, thank you for the sub, or Kalish. Stormbird, 44 months, and uh, Michog, or Michog, or Mitch OG. Thank you for the sub, much appreciated. You need an otter cam? <gasps> I'm out of stamina. All right. Do I have the, I do have the umbrella. That's good news. Okie dokie. So, we arrive, and um, I didn't bring any blocks, did I? That was uh, not the not my proudest moment. Don't worry, I can grab some real quick. Quick and easy from here, and then uh, that, that'll be uh, kind of important, I think. And then I'll just light this area up, and hopefully no Zandy spawn inside of it, and then I can just block it off. And Hi, Subway! Yo, okay, we can actually make super glue. What the frick are you doing in my subway? These guys, these guys. This is ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Yeah, they might have spawned on top of the cobblestone and walked in or something. It's possible. All right, spicy tater toff, 21 months big. Woohoo. Hello, Punju. Yes. It is me, race car driver turned Mary Poppins. I think I do a better job at Mary Poppins than being a race car driver. Is that the same guy? It is, yeah. Okay. Um, you know what? I hope you're having a great time hanging out here because uh, I can't hear you upstairs, and for that, you shall live. Okay, guys, 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 guys. What are we gonna do? What are we gonna do here? Pretty low on the whole gasoline thing. So I'm gonna go, we're gonna need to make a run for filling up our canisters. I think, but actually, before that, I could, I could get an elevator set up. I don't know if people are thinking like uh, that's something I should do, but I could do it. Anyway, let's get this stuff dropped off. Mm, I guess I can't really leave that down there unless I just put it in another chest. Um. Hold on. The mod says the six cylinder does make it faster, but it uses more fuel. So I'm very curious on a miles per gallon basis though, if it's going faster, is it still using the same amount of fuel per distance unit? In which case it just actually makes no difference. And we want to go fast, so. All right, guys, I'm going to, uh, I'm going to go grab a different drinky, and I will be right back.
All right. Let's think now. Let's think. What the play is going to be. What is the play going to be here? You know? How should we approach? How should we approach this? How should we approach this situation, y'all? Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Trying to think. Should we go in... Should we hit up the other apartment tower, or should we try to hit up... Like, try to drive around and find a, uh, a mega tower. But also, if the mega tower is a horde building, then it's... I think maybe I should try the horde in the apartment tower before we hit up the mega, because there's no way that the mega is there's no way that the mega tower is not going to have a horde chunk in it there's no way so maybe yeah okay you know what why don't we try to get an elevator set up here now that we've got some slime we can make ourselves some super glue which is necessary in order to do the stuff here we go. Or the base and the ceiling of the elevator, and then maybe some walls to go with it. God, I would need like 18. Okay, and then, or I could use shafts. Either walls or shafts. I can't remember. Shafts might not be considered a valid block for the elevator. Hmm. Was it that shafts are like not okay? Or something like that? I just don't recall. Might need some more there. And then, um... I'm gonna have to just... Oh, God, I'm gonna have to do the freaking thing where... Okay, gearbox. Need gearboxes. Um, you just do a floor and a, a single ceiling block? No, I wouldn't need to do that right now. Oh, yeah, so a suppressor would be good for my gun. I should make the gun table. It's not wrong. Um, okay, so we're gonna need gearboxes, we're gonna need shafts. Can't remember if I speed it up, if it's gonna be... If it's gonna impact things, but anyway, okay, so... Yeah, up we go, I probably need some stone bricks as well. Okay. So the real question here is, how high do I need to make this? For it to, I think, we're going to want to go at least just one more floor high. And um, so because of that, let's just make like a partial roof that extends to where the elevator will start. And this will be basically the top. Our boy. Wait. Where is our boy, speaking of? Wait. I hear him. Oh, he's over there. Okay. He's over there. Everything is good. Uh, how are we going to do this? Am I going to do, like, a fence around? That's going to eat into the space. Oh, that's going to be so inconvenient. Oh, no. Oh, no. Um. Oh, I need to plan housing space for Bullet Factory. Ooh. I mean... I think we could do it on this, uh, the floor above this will probably work fine. Alright, so that's gonna be there, so... Do that. Okay. I wonder if the best way to do it is actually just, like, give the otter a pen. Yeah, that's going to be the best way to do it. Hold on. Um...
Okay, guys. This is just... This is going to be temporary. Okay? Until we relocate the otter. Because we can pick him up out of here. And we can, we can bring him up somewhere else. Right? And then it'll be great. Oh, I hear a freaking demolisher. God, I love the high-resistance fabric from him. But at, like, one mile an hour up and down floors, and that's gonna be really annoying. So, I'm gonna, I'm gonna say, let's do it that way. Let's, let's speed this thing up. Let's do some Cogger's Champions up here. And then, um, hope that it works out. That is literally the opposite of what I needed to do. And this is why I need the wrench. Okay, and then if we can still do that there. And then do we do one more speed up? Maybe like one more speed up. I think would be good. That's a little annoying. It's a little annoying location wise. I guess I could just have it go around the other side. I could do I could do one more drop down. We could go insane. Go insane with it. We could go insane with it. Does the pulley have to be in the middle? It doesn't actually, but that gave us an opportunity. So that'll just be the uh, elevator housing on the roof of our building. Okay. It's moving fast. It be vrooming, dude. The quad step downs or something. Anyway, now we can do super glue. Let's see if I can get this proper. Good. And um what'll be what'll be top floor? Or maybe no, I should probably keep them numbered. I should probably I'll change them to numbers. Let me get these hooked up all the way down. And, uh, hope that it works. God dang it. <laughs> ah, it's gonna be stupid, isn't it? It's gonna be- Oh, God, let me down. Alright, let me get this sorted out. That's gonna be there. That's gonna be Frick. Damn it. It's gonna be there. Need to retrieve, get rid of that water. Actually, I didn't need to do that yet. Oh well, it's fine. Okay, then one more redstone contact. Where's the otter? Safe. Don't worry. Everything's good. I think that is all the redstone contacts in place. Now we just need to head back up 
Make sure all of the floors are clear. Get rid of, uh, oh, I gotta get the ladders destroyed as I go up. And, uh, hope that we will be good. This isn't dangerous at all for us, working over this open pit. Okay, that's gonna be bad. That's gonna be real freaking bad. sec. Um, Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh, Mr. Norton says a bad bug is part of the thing he gave me. Uh, what happened to any chunks I loaded... Uh-oh. I hope I haven't destroyed my world. Oh, immersive machines just won't be assembled. Oh, okay. That's not too big of a deal. That's all good. You scared me. You scared me for a second there, man. There may be random command blocks. Oh, that's interesting. <laughs> hmm. Okay. That sounds like fun, though, if we'd actually run into it. Uh, I will get that updated before next time. Okay. <laughs> Wouldn't it be really great if we accidentally fell into this pit? I think that'd be really fun. Uh, it's a good thing we blocked it off for the otters anyway. All right. I believe that this means... We have an assembly, right? Let's see, zero to negative four. I feel like we're gonna need to change the names on these. Should I have made this structure one block higher? I might have wanted, that's a little, mm, that doesn't blend into the roof line very well, if I'm being honest. I may have made a boo-boo there. Oh well, it's nothing that can't be fixed. Let's just go back up to zero and we'll fix it. Okay. I, yeah, he's a bit of an oopsie, that one. He's a bit of an oopsie. I think that it's okay, though, if we just, um... I think we can... I think we can just, like, hit, hit this, right? It'll undo. And just... Expand this. And hopefully, uh, we don't even need to... Move the pulley up. Hopefully we can just... Boom, 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 boom. And then on top of that... Cogger's champion. Um, I could do this. That. Well, you know what I could do, which actually be kind of nice. I could do this, this, and then we slab in between, right? I like that, that, that. Balls. Do something like that. And then we got to do... One more super glue to there. Okay. All right, hopefully this will work and it'll just assemble even though there's like no gap. There we go. Okay. 
Now, let's do negative two. Hopefully it'll blend right in. Oh yeah, now that's looking nice right there. Now that's more beautiful elevator. -y. Negative four, let's go all the way down. I like had to shift in order to get in, but when you're on here, you can't shift because that's how create things work. So I was always in this freaking situation where I just like, it was so hard for me to use my elevator. So, this is excellent. I love this, dude, I love this. This is freaking awesome. Uh, okay. Epic stuff. Let's freaking go, dude. Alrighty. Get all this back. Um. Time to get rid of the ladder block? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're right. Let me get rid of this. Blah. Let's hope we don't have a power outage. We're uh, not very up to code with the no emergency stairs situation, right? Cool. Okay. Oh, yeah, I kind of need a button. You're right. You're right. I do need buttons. That's so true. Uh, let me do four, I guess. One, two, three, four, five. Uh, in case we exit out of the base a different way. I need five, don't we? Good call. Good call. Okay. Yeah, would be would be a little unfortunate if we uh No, Rick. Would be a little unfortunate if we ended up uh, not being able to access our elevator because we forgot to do some buttons. Let me just make sure that it is the button on the redstone contact that makes the thing actually work here. Let me just double check. And uh, hope that bad things don't happen. It's about nighttime, though, so I don't know. I might want to sleep it through and then make a run for it in the daytime. I just don't remember what a gas station looks like from overhead. Is it that? Oh, God. What does a gas station look like from overhead? Anybody remember this? And just carry the gas station? I, I don't know why it doesn't work in this. I don't know if it was updated. Large slab of stone with an asphalt U or N? Hmm... Hmm. South of the city. There's a gap. Oh, this here? Okay, I see it. Got it, got it, got it. Oh, there's one. That might be... Is that the closest one? Um, are there any near a subway exit that we've got? Yeah, it might it might be this this one here. Oh, there is one right there. I see it. Okay, I could... I could go for... Ooh. It's not very close to a subway exit, though, which scares me a bit. I think maybe just do here. And then... Run it over to... Where was it? Run it over there, maybe. Do that. Maybe that. I just don't love digging up, but I just don't understand why we can't, um, I just don't understand why the frick we have no ability to pick up the gas stations this time. I don't know why. Could do another one of these as well. How many Duraplasts do I have? 15? Ooh, that would be, no, that would be using a lot. Um, 
Hmm. Umbrella glide time doesn't give me a way to get back here, though, is the issue. So. Alrighty. Um. Let's see, let's see. Mr. Milky Way, thank you for the three months. Much appreciated, dude. Very swick. Also, I gotta check what time my car is coming back, if anything has happened. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, the umbrella has durability. It doesn't seem like it goes down very quickly. Canister in the backpack? What do you mean? What do you mean? I didn't have any additional canisters in the backpack. All right. All right. Well, that'll be the play. Let's do... How do we want to do this? Do we want to just run this on foot? Do we want to just run this on foot? Oh, wait. No, let me sleep. And then I suppose we can just run this on foot. And uh, load up the couple of cherry cans, and that's that. Go! Get back! Dude, we can take both of these, and then we have gas forever. Come on, let's go! I can just park the car straight in front of this, and we'll be good. I could even make a run back. I make a run back to try to get the other one. I can collect all of the gas station pumps in the immediate vicinity. All right, one sec. Okay. Sorry, just checking for status of car getting sent back from service. All right, we made it back, baby! Okay, so the question is, if I just put these next to the thing, right, and then I go... Start it up. Right, uh, uh, and then, oh yeah, right. Can't even believe it, man. I can't even, I can't even believe it, dude. Now it works. Of course it does. Maybe it was the bigger cars. Maybe it's the sports cars that you can't carry. Or that you can carry. And it's like the bigger ones that are just... They're too heavy or something. That's gotta be what it is. It couldn't be that I just wasn't getting the hitbox, right? Um. Okay. No, I know you guys mentioned being able to pick up cars. Like, you did. But it wasn't working. It just wasn't working. Uh, any? I haven't... Oh, I haven't done a drinky on the OJ. Yeah, blocks, 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 blocks. For sure, for sure. I never aimed at the hot box correctly. Yeah. Dang, bro. Didn't get that hot box. Go ahead. Oh! Hey, I haven't checked on the villagers. Yo, we got three babies! Oh my god! Oh my god, bro. It's villagering time. Wait, 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 wait. Do I have any more taters here? Got any more taters? Not very many taters, but boy, oh boy, do we have ourselves some bone meal, bro. Let's do another stack. What? In terms of terms of villagers that we might want to trade with. Um, oh, you know, of course, a freaking librarian, right? Because we can get Unbreaking at Civ Luck. 
But it would be good. Wait, did you guys just pop out another? They popped out another one! It's relentless! Oh my god, shout out to these mans. Oh, fortune. Okay, you know what? Fortune plus unbreaking would be good too. We could then get fortune onto our pickaxe. Not that it really applies too much, but let's see. Sweepy. Worst might. Loyalty. Chain. Pow. Frost. Oh, digging does. Fortune. Wait. Reclaimed and smite. Um. Hmm. If we used reclaimed, we could just apply it to our pistol, and then we'd be able to save a bunch of ammo. You know. Um. Do we have another adult villager by any chance that we'd be able to put in? Not yet, unfortunately. So, um. Hmm. We need a money block. I just want to see, like, how much it'll move the needle. Oh, wow, it's a full level if I if I buy a reclaimed. But also, unbreaking is useful. Uh, hmm. I'll keep it going. Reclaimed and aqua affinity. Come on, come on, come on. Unbreaking. Unbreaking. I just want to get two... If if we get two useful ones, be very nice. Like, unbreaky fortune, or unbreaky reclaimed, or reclaimed in fortune. Just gonna keep trying. Wait, is it C to do this? C to cycle? Oh, whatever. Ah, oh, man, come on. Damn it. Damn it. Guys, we're gonna get there eventually. I just know it. And we're probably gonna get there, and then I'm gonna, I'm gonna uh, auto, just hit cycle on it. And I'm gonna be like, oh shoot. Mm, sharpness doesn't have as much utility. Just trying to kind of min max because you don't have much money. Oh wait. Oh, hold on. We did. We did just get ourselves another villager here, so I could do multiple, but it would ju it just allows us if we do it on one villager to like rank it up quicker. That's the only thing. It'll eventually be what I want. No. Damn it. Damn it. Come on! I just don't like to settle for mediocrity. No. No. I suppose looting I could take, too. Damn it. I'm actually really surprised at this point we have not paired up two of my desired useful enchantments. I wonder if maybe they actually can't happen? Mm. 
All right, whatever. I'm about to settle. What the frick is Heckfire? Cool. Doesn't doesn't tell me. Uh, maybe I would I would like something where the other one can actually be I don't know bought once. Twenty seven hours late. They're really it gave me the same combo, unbreaking and hackfire. I don't even know what hackfire is, so it's like why. Um okay. Oh god, I have a feather falling. Oh, it's for the create flamethrower. Alright. You know what? Whatever. We'll just we'll just do this. There it is. We're gonna lock in a reclaimed, and then we'll do another trader. In order to do a second guy who has um, some other stuff. Let me make another lectern and then we'll get unbreak. Oh, I swear this guy's going to get me reclaimed and unbreaking and I'm going to lose it. Actually, this worked out perfectly. It worked out perfectly. We just got fortune and unbreaked again. The workshop. Uh, frick. Was it? Oh, yeah. It is simply the workbench. Oh. Deals, dude. What a guy. What a machine. There you go. A new food. New food. I do want to put that back in the system. Yeah. <laughs> Why did he spawn there? That was such a dumb place for him to come into existence. Guess you can't pick where you're born, huh? Guess you can't. All right. Um, okay. All right. Where is the other apartment building? Okay, it's probably just do the, oh, I'm gonna need blocks. I'm gonna need blocks for this big time. I'm gonna need to do that. Okay. I think the play here probably is just, um, Bring the car over to the subway entrance once again. And then, um, I think we just run over. I, we're overshooting the location of the apartment tower, like, a little bit, but... Go to the other side. <laughs> and not encounter a horde building. Oh, good, just lots of different types of rocks in here. Let me just get some rocks real quick. And, um, then we will... Try to hit up the apartment tower. Fingers crossed we can make it happen. Hmm. I'm not sure I like that too much. Hordes will now flood into the subway via the nearby entrance. Ah, uh, I don't think I don't think we're in that much danger. I mean, maybe famous last words, but I think we'll be okay. I'm hoping that is good for blocks. And now we can get going. 
we can get going. Here we go, everybody. It is time. And also, shout out Mr. Norton once again. The only reason that we can do sorting in these sorts of things is because of his quality of life edition that he gave us, which is very cool. Very awesome. Alrighty, let's go through more of the loot. One sec. Sorry, they're just letting me know the car is being loaded. Okay. Money, 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 money. Money, oh my god, dude, we're actually hitting the jackpot on this. I shouldn't say anything, no, if I, ooh, Crystal Heart, oh, right, we've been, um, oh, no, I was thinking, uh, I was thinking freaking Pokemans we found this, wait, no, this is, a, this is Mega. Oh my god, five more monies? Bro, we're up to 24 money blocks, this stuff, oh my god, we're getting the hugest money generation, there's no way this is gonna continue, this is gonna, there's no way that this is gonna continue into the next room, I just, I can't, I can't imagine. It can't possibly... Okay, they're running out of money here. We might have gone through the savings. Sorry, one sec. Um... Sorry, they, uh... Because the mono is open... Open on the top, they... Usually do a closed a closed cabin transport um, inside of a truck, uh, but for some reason with this service, they just despite my asking are not doing it, and so I'm like, uh, I'm I'm like, 
between just letting it go and it's going to arrive with the interior being like hot as the surface of the sun and I'm like I won't be able to actually possibly won't be able to actually get in and sit in it in order to get it like from where it's being dropped off back home uh or I have to you know put the cover on for the transport but then I'm worried about the cover blowing off which I I was there to supervise how it was like put on when it got sent there but now they I just saw a picture of it being loaded and I'm like oh it's another open cockpit again frick um oh it's not going to rain that's not an issue Uh, oh, just throw in a bag of ice. <laughs> hey, yay, yay. I might just have to, like, sit in the shade for a bit and then and wait. I don't know. Yeah, sorry. One more, one more message. Okay. Um, let's see. Evil Man Ray, thank you for the 960 bits. Long time fan. Love seeing you still playing Minecraft after all these years. Thank you very much. Boyosuke with three months. We just want to let you know my favorite streamer. Can't watch right now, but thanks for being awesome. Well, no worries. That's why these go up on YouTube as well. Yeah. Any luck with the Porsche? Or you mean like with, with the GT3 RS? It's not going to happen. There's no way in a million years. It was kind of a joke, my leaving the comment, but also not a joke. It was like, it was like, uh, you know, um, want me to put my Minecraft bed next to yours? <laughs> Lol, JK, unless it was that kind of, that kind of thing, you know? Um... <laughs> okay. All right. I think uh, that's all set, right? Oh, no. More money. Five more monies. Oh, my God. This is actual insanity. Bro. Bro. Is there more? Is there more? Come on. Come on. There can be more money there, too. Gapples? Gapples? Broken magnet. Oh, no. That good stuff. What about over here? Yummy, yummy. And my dummy. Okay. Cool, 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 cool. And yeah, so this is this is like the less loaded side. I think the other side usually has more stuff, but I feel like there's no way we're gonna get nearly as lucky on um, as much money on the other side. But you never know. Fingers crossed. I leave rubber in the cabinet to the right? I don't think so. I left the super magnet because we already got one. All right. So, um, what's our best course of action here? I'm just wondering, like, should I, should I go over via the inside? I was just worried if I pop my head out of the roof 
that we might just get Goomba stomped, which is never good. So, I don't know, let's just deal with these guys here, and we'll go over to the other penthouse via the interior. And then also, like, the immersive, I guess I could just yoink some immersive real quick, and maybe some create stuff. But other than that, I think we're pretty good. That was a that was way better than the first building that we hit up, though. First apartment building that we hit up. Way more profitable. Way better. I'm just gonna clear these things out real quick, get the create stuff from inside, and we will be good to go. I don't actually think I need all of these. Maybe just like the steel scaffolding and the treated planks and stuff. That was weird. It treated the uh, the the wood as metal. All right, and then there's a bit of create stuff. Oh, maybe better because we had the uh, luck stuff? Uh, maybe. I don't know. With all that stuff mined, I think our uh, I think our best bet is to head on back. We entered from the uh, subway, and we will head back there to the vehicle. I could just can by four. A lot of things to do, but for the thing, I think we'll wind down the episode and sort this out in between. So thanks for to like the video, subscribe to too to stay tuned for the episodes if you missed any in the description and follow them live thanks for uh checking in and see you next time that was good um so Unfortunately, I don't think I can do another session because the car is probably going to be here in like an hour and 15 and um, I have to uh, I have to probably because car is streaming walk. Basically, street is too narrow. The tow truck can't. It could, but it's a pain. I try not to make the tow truck suffer. Um, so I just go to where the street is not as narrow and meet it there, and that requires a bit of a walk, so really it only gives me an hour, so we would be real, real borderline on the edge of being able to do another session on, uh, Pokey or something like that. So. Anyway, um, I guess we will leave it off there. Sure, we could raid Crumb, that sounds good. So, uh, yeah, thanks for watching, everybody, and I will catch you probably tomorrow. Okie dokie. Bye-bye.